Welcome or welcome back at any help at Cisco. In this example, we're going to use a graphing calculator to solve this equation. And I'm going to use a TI-83. And the first thing you want to do is to click on the Y equals button, which is right here. And you're going to get a menu like this. And then again, you're going to type in on Y1 this equation and on Y2 this equation using the keyboard. And you see that in my uh, next picture right here. Now we're going to move to the next step. We're going to want to see how the graph looks like. So I click the button that is called graph, which is right here. And this is the graph I get. And then I will adjust the window if necessary. In this case, it's not really necessary, but I'll adjust to get a better picture. For that reason, I click the window button. And you see this window. It's the classic window you get if your calculator was resetted. Now you can use the picture you have and adjust the picture, which I did it. It's right here. It's the same graph in a different window. Well, I think it's better for me to use this window for the next stage, which is to calculate, to find the solution of this equation. And you notice I said here, second calc. So you're going to click this button and this button, and you're going to get this screen. And you notice the number five here, it's called intersect so you can use this arrow and scroll down until this is an active uh, icon or you can simply click number five and then you're going to have to press enter and then you're going to have to press enter to select your graphs first curve like here which is y1 second curve like here which is y2 and then you're going to be asked to guess a number you guess a number close to your intersection point I said here, but you, can, can, you don't really have to be that close. In fact, if you notice here, I guess 3, which is pretty far from, let's say, this X we have here. So you can go closer if you want. Just guess a number, be in the window, be sure you are in the window, and then click Enter. And then you're going to have the solution. And in this case, the first solution is X equals point. 75 you notice here how do i get this solution i'm going to follow the same steps if you remember second calc number five the uh, calculate the intersection then uh, enter first curve second curve guess and then you're gonna guess something uh, to the left here so like a negative uh, three will be fine and you should get the uh, second solution which is negative 2.94 so now we have both solution if you enjoyed this video don't forget to click the like button and come back on c square for more help thank you